Hi everyone, I am Uday. My project for this is about uh, sending HTML emails from monday.com. Just to give some background about this project, uh, monday.com is great and it supports a lot of use cases. However, its email integration is not the greatest. You know, while sending text based emails are sufficient for a lot of internal use cases, it's not ideal when there is a need to send updates to external clients or customers. Especially for using monday.com in, you know, use cases like CRM, sales, customer success, etc. In those cases, text-based emails slightly fall short. There have been numerous posts about HTML emails in the entire monday.com community. I've been going through a lot of them. And I just wanted to take a stab at this problem and see if I can solve it. And here's the result of that effort. These are the features of the app. Uh, this is a public facing app, so anyone can uh, install this. And this is a combination of a view as well as an integration. View is the email builder. And I also have custom email templates to support the view. This feature has uh, email sending integration along with merge tags. Whenever uh, this, this app sends emails out, it also creates an update in monday.com. And custom domain email addresses are also possible, but only after the DKIM verification. I can go through that later. Let's see the demo of the app. So just to see the install status, this is not installed yet. Uh, since this is a public facing app, I can do a no auth. The app is now installed. Let's see uh, how it works. Let me go to the view by adding the view. Apps and email editor. So this is the email editor. This is a drag and drop email editor with most commonly used email blocks. These blocks can be dragged and dropped onto the canvas. Uh, let me show you some default templates. So this has the list of default templates in here. Let's load one of them. Behind the scenes, uh, this app uses MJML. Uh, which is the MailJet markup language. This is just like HTML for emails, but MJML is responsive by design. Let, let me drop uh, a few of these blocks in here. This is a nav bar and we can adjust all these settings and also, uh, you know, you add HTML and CSS. These are all various devices, how this email looks. Since MJML is responsive by design, all the components get readjusted. Let me go back to the default view. These are all the blocks. I can drop uh, some of these blocks in here. Uh, this is an image block. Right now, only the links for the images work. Uh, dragging and dropping files and uploading will not work yet. I'm currently working on it. Let's take uh, an image and copy the link for that. Just like this, we can add an image. I can also show by adding some text blocks. These text blocks can be adjusted uh, in this view. We can adjust the fonts, colors, sizes, all the things. Let me add a font color. And also I can add a background color. <laughs> I'm not I'm not the best designer in this. 
and this also supports uh, merge tags let's say i can add a merge tag like this and the data from that pulse will be replaced with with, with this tag now let me go back let me save this template to save a template i just need to click on the save icon and once the save is success we can see template saved successfully let me use it in a recipe even though this is a view uh, unlike other views this is not tied to a particular board you can use this email edit you can use this email template in any view any boards actually let me create a new board altogether i can now show you the integration how the integration works based on the view that we have created so going to the integrations selecting the apps and these are all the recipes uh, that the app currently supports let me pick the first one uh, when a status changes to something send an email with the template that we have created and we can also choose the subject and the email column so before doing this let me add an email column i can give i have created a test email uh, gmail address i can give that address here and add one of these recipes i'll pick this one uh, when a status changes to something send an email with template and subject to this email column since we already did the oauth it should automatically redirect back to the recipe yep so let's pick status changes to anything can use the email template that we just created on subject we can pick anything let's say demo subject and to the email column that we just created add to board now that the recipe is here let me update a status said done so as soon as an email is sent out uh, there will be an update that will be written on to the updates column i saw an email already created here and an update i'm not sure why it is not loading let me reload and in the meantime you can see the email that has come to my mailbox uh subject is demo subject the email template that we just built and if you see this here uh, i'm also seeing the pulse so that the same email should be added to uh, you know the pulse as an update but i'm not sure that feature is not working yet i'll need to check with the monday team but yeah let's get back let's see if the update is now visible yeah now you can see the update uh, email with subject demo subject sent successfully to so and so email address i wanted to show the entire email but 
yeah like i said it's not working yet now let me show you uh, another another table uh, another board where i've already created two integrations uh, one with the email sending integration with html email and the another one with the existing gmail integration with almost the same uh, you know email details i wanted to show you the difference you know how the text based email looks and the html based email looks i won't create the entire template once again uh, i've already created uh, a template for this let me load that one here since i've already added that view in here i can also import uh, mjml raw mjml and render it as a template i just did that uh, i've created this email template beforehand let's say this is i've already added this to the integration let, let me see what i call it order receipt now i just want to trigger one of these receipts based on the integration uh, when the stage changes to anything the integration will trigger let me update a stage i'll update this to prospect and an email is already generated so we have now two emails uh, one with the existing gmail integration with text based you know templatized email i've have already replaced the first name order date you know pickup date contact details etc and the order status and i've created a similar email from the html and this is how it looks i've replaced uh, the first name the order status order number order date total price i can also link these buttons to you know whatever store you have i currently linked it one to google.com and the other one to monday.com yeah that's all i have for this demo uh, feel free to give me some feedback and the other use cases that you're looking for i'll try to constantly improve this app and see where this goes the issues currently i'm seeing with this app are not all the merge tags are supported uh, i can give some write up on which merge tags are working uh, as of right now all the pulse merge tags will work but not the user merge tags and the board merge tags like the other uh, native gmail integration merge tags i let uh, a small write up on that which ones work and which ones do not thank you everyone